Yeah, so an ISV stands for an independent software vendor. Um, pretty much the term has been used historically uh, to define uh, companies that are uh, producing intellectual property um, and are not just services companies, but they actually have a software product and intellectual property um, that they are uh, part of a larger software ecosystem. So for example, uh, in the 1960s, it's, uh, the term actually came out of uh, IBM, where IBM had a lot of software in the financial services industry and in the banking industry. Um, and uh, there were many other smaller software players who wanted to be in IBM's ecosystem. And that's kind of where the term independent software vendor came from. Um, and today what happens is uh, every large software manufacturer has uh, a partner ecosystem uh, of which the independent software vendor uh, is one of the most fundamental um, to add value to the customer. Because from the customer's perspective, they look at the core software, but the core software is not good enough for them to take them farther. They actually need innovation that is coming from the independent software vendors. Um, and, and, and together, the core software as well as the independent software vendors uh, solution jointly um, add up to a significant value proposition for the end customer.